Hi folks, Jason Clemens here from Clemens Boats in Sandusky, Ohio. Today we are taking a look at our 2016 Cobalt 336. Gorgeous looking boat. We have it with the navy hull side with sandstone stripe. As you can see the finish is great. It's like a mirror. Cobalt leaves their boats in the mold for six days so you get that great finish. You don't get any waves. Looks like a mirror. Beautiful looking boat. All hand laid fiberglass. There's no trim tape on the boat. So all this stuff that you see here, that is all in the gel coat. You don't have to worry about marring up any uh, trim tape. You got a nice stainless steel scuff plate, stainless steel anchor for your bow windlass there, and stainless steel rub rail. This is an all hand laid fiberglass boat. There's no chop in the boat. All hand laid fiberglass, no wood in the boat. Give you a shot of the port side here. It's jammed in here, but it gives you a good idea of what you're looking at. Bear with me as I walk up top the scaffolding here. We've got everything kind of jammed in here for the winter so you can look at boats in the comfort of some heat here and not be outside looking. It's nine degrees out today, so this definitely wouldn't be a day that we could look at any boats if we didn't have them inside here. We've got an R5 Cobalt, an R7, and a 336 all in a row here. Bear with me as I walk on down here. One of the nice things about this 336 is although it's a 33 foot bow rider, overall length I think is closer to 35, it does have a small cabin on it. So you can take a lot of people on the boat. It's a great day boat, but if you want to stay on it overnight or the weather turns bad when you're on an island, you have somewhere to stay. It does have the swim step on the uh, platform here that drops down. That's great for pets. It's also really comfortable to get in and out of the water on. You have a ski bar there on the back. You also have a tow point from the arch uh, up top if you need it. Um, this is available with the hard top or without the hard top. With the hard top, uh, you're much better pulling from the rear uh, spot here. Big sun pad on the back. There is some storage underneath that. That backrest will flip forward and back. As you can see here, you do have a couple of cup holders here on the corner, a little storage pod, and your uh, stereo remote for the transom. We do have seagrass carpet in this boat. Beautiful finish. It's got the Terra interior with seagrass carpet and again the hard top. Give you a look at the stats here for the boat. 34 foot 9 inches overall, 10 7 wide, 9 foot interior cockpit width which is important, and a 22 degree dead rise, 174 gallons of fuel. This one is powered by twin Mercury 8.2 mags, 380 horsepower piece, so the boat's got plenty of power for you. Table here on the port side of the boat that does hide away on the bracket. It slides right in, so it's a real slick way to have a table, be able to hide it to where it's uh, hidden without having to take it off or store it away anywhere else. It's a real nice feature. A backrest on the port side that flips either way, so if you have people on the boat and you want to be social, you can flip it the other way and face aft or the way it is now and face forward. It does have a built-in cooler here on this side. That's well insulated so that's a good place to keep beverages cold or food cold. You do also have a gate, a stainless steel gate here for the walkthrough. The boat does have fender clips on it. I believe there's three on each side. If you've not seen that feature that's a real nice feature to have. If you have people on the boat with you that haven't done a ton of boating it's a great way to put the fenders from one side to the other by just clicking a button. No adjustments needed. And since there's no trim tape on the side of the boat, you don't have to worry about uh, any issues with marring uh, trim tape up. It works really good. Let's open up your storage pods here. You've got a small trash can and some storage there. Another great feature that it has is a microwave and a refrigerator here in the cockpit. And you do have some GFIs and an uh, outlet for a TV. Of course, you do have a sink here on the back, a nice uh, sink with a hard surface countertop. All the inlays here are diamond stitched. Very beautiful upholstery, all, all uh, handmade inlays here. You can get a real good shot of it on this side. But very, just a gorgeous finished off boat. They do use vinyl on their dashes that keeps your glare down and on top of that just looks really classy. It looks gorgeous. You do have a Garmin touchscreen 741 GPS. You've got all your instrumentation here, and then you also have your vessel view system down here. Kicker stereo. And then you've got your uh, Skyhook uh, and Axios gauges there. This does have the Axios joystick drive. 
automatic trim tabs, so self-leveling trim tabs, and then you also have your uh, digital throttles here so you can run the boat synced, separate, or in a docking situation, uh, have docking mode or put the joystick on. Another small feature, but it does have a place to put your elbow when you're running the boat. Very comfortable. You do have a VHF radio, as you can see there. Nice double-wide helm chair with flip-up bolster. The boat's a breeze to drive, very comfortable, has a wonderful look here. I'm up on the bolster. As you can see, I can see right through the windshield. It's got a great line of sight. Very comfortable and just finished off. Finished off incredible. Cobalt doesn't compromise anything. They do a wonderful job with their uh, their finishing, uh, their finished work. Just, just a great job. Boat rides real well, performs real well. Just truly a compromise nothing brand. As you can see here, here's the cabin of the boat does have a flat screen TV, does also have air conditioning. This bed here, or I'm sorry, a couch will fold out into a bed. So you can sleep two people down here comfortably if you get stuck somewhere, if you're up at the lake for the weekend. Great feature to have, big open boat, but you also have somewhere to sleep. And then of course, you've got your head compartment on this side with solid surface countertop, sink, and then of course an electric head here. There's also a cushion for it if you're just using it for a changing room. Uh, where you don't have to sit on the toilet. There's actually a board in there, which is great As we walk through here You can see you've got a, a door here to cut off from the bow If you've got some inclement weather and you don't want to have your bow cover on there is a locker here in the floor That's just hidden away Big wraparound bow here in the front You do have a table leg for a bow table here and a place for that to store Of course a windlass here with stainless anchor does have a nice gas shock arm on it Great windlass, you've got your uh, up and down switches here and you also have a pair at the dash and of course your safety uh, mechanism there of a rope holding it up. Pop up cleats here in the bow and then of course your seat here on this side with an armrest so you can uh, be in comfort there as well. Very nice boat, there are so many features on a boat like this there's no way we can get them to you in a video, uh, inventory video here. We know you're going to have questions. Please give us a call at 419-684-5365 when those questions arise and we'll have one of our sales professionals guide you through the boat here. Set an appointment where you can come take a look at it. You can also check us out at clemensboats.com. While you're there, don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter so you can keep up with what's new at Clemens Boats. And again, if you have any questions, please get a hold of us. We'd love a chance at earning your business and showing you why Clemens Boats and why Cobalt as a brand is different. Have a great day.